And he sticks the landing. Have you ever been killing zombies and thought to yourself, Man, I sure wish I could be playing as a homeless guy right about now. Well, you're in luck, friend. Because with the Breakdown DLC for State of Decay, that is a very real possibility. Breakdown is basically just State of Decay without the plot, and is essentially a pure survival mode in which you can build up your community of survivors and just generally try and survive as long as possible. And if you're looking for a challenge, you can actually move up difficulty levels, and this is accomplished by finding an RV somewhere on the map and fixing it up after you've settled in for a little bit. And once it's ready to go, you will have your progress reset, be taken to a new instance of the map, and uh, have to deal with stuff like fewer resources, faster zombies, and, uh, you know, special infected types spawning much more frequently. You can also unlock hero types by beating certain challenges. In this video, we'll be seeing the cop and the mother. Each of these heroes gets their own perks and their own starting equipment. The mother, for instance, starts off with a rolling pin and a revolver. So, mom's packing heat. And I think you'll find the mother can be pretty sweet and supportive. She's a nice lady, especially in the middle of a zombie apocalypse. Oh, honey, that's wonderful. Oh, thanks, mom. God damn it, eat shit, you dead bastards! Oh, mom, no. Chew on this, motherfuckers! Oh, I don't like it when mom uses bad language. So what you're seeing with the mother here is difficulty level three. As of this recording, I am on level four, I believe. If you end up failing, which uh, you fail just when you don't have any more survivors to play as, then you can just start off at whatever the highest difficulty you've made it to is. And I don't think there's any limit to how high the levels go. I wouldn't think so. And so, like I said, I'm only at level four right now, but, oh, whew, let me tell you, it certainly gets tough, especially when they start throwing tons of fast zombies at you. And what they'll do is, when you reset your progress and start a new home base, they'll just throw wave after wave of hordes for you to deal with for a while. And if they make it to your base, you get stuff like this. Yeah, I actually did make it out of this encounter. Uh, it uh, took quite a while. Just goes to show that Mom's got Moxie. Huh? That place takes me back. Lost my virginity back there. Me and Lucy Cormoran, junior year. She had this thing where. Oof. Um. Yeah. Sorry. Too much information. You lost your virginity at the post office? Okay, whatever you say. This is the cop, a hero you can unlock by getting 50 pistol kills. He starts off with a riot baton and a pistol, and he also has an ability called Focus Aim, where when you activate it, you'll slow down time to really line up those shots. I guess maybe he's, like, holding his breath or something? I don't really know how it works. He's a cop and also a Time Lord, apparently. And the cop isn't the only one who has that focus aim ability. You can specialize in a bunch of different offense techniques, like blunt weapons, or pistols, or shotguns. Uh, but he just starts off with it automatically, instead of having to level it up. He's probably one of the easier heroes to unlock. You can only get certain heroes when you make it to certain difficulty levels, but with the cop you can get him right at level 1. The only thing is, your challenge progress will reset once you move up a level, so you'll have to get the 50 kills all in one go before you fix up your RV and take off in it. So, just something to keep in mind. 
So yeah, I think I'll make a few more videos for the Breakdown DLC. Show off any interesting characters I might unlock, or any highlight real moments. Like this one, for instance, where I have some choice words for this zombie. Fuck you! Oh man, all he wanted was to open the door. I think I might have some rage problems. I learned it from watching you, Mom!